Adele has been through a whirlwind of life changes in recent years after going through a remarkable weight loss journey while battling a heartbreaking divorce to her partner of eight years. The star has seemingly had a glow up both physically and mentally, and the rolling in the deep star shocked fans when she uploaded a picture of herself in 2019 showing off her phenomenal new figure after losing an incredible 100 pounds over the course of two years. In the same year, the British singer announced her split from her long-term partner Simon Konecki whom she married just 11 months before filing for divorce according to the Daily Mail. The songwriter, who recently surprised James Corden for one final episode of his iconic carpool karaoke, has now moved on to a new chapter of her life with Beau Rich Paul. But most importantly of all, Adele has discovered a newfound love with herself as she revealed in an Instagram post that she's the happiest she has ever been. Here we take a closer look at the star's inspiring weight loss journey, her divorce from her husband and her new love. Weight loss Adele made headlines in 2019 when she shocked the world with her remarkable 100-pound weight loss. The singer showcased her incredible new figure to her 53. 3 million Instagram followers when she uploaded a bombshell picture of herself in a dress to celebrate her 32nd birthday. Adele revealed she first started working out to cope with the stress of her divorce from Simon Konecki in 2019. She used exercise as a way of dealing with her terrifying anxiety attacks after she left her marriage as well as striving to build up her own strength. The star lost the bulk of her weight during the COVID-19 lockdown restrictions as she revealed she was working out three times a day. She detailed that her workout plans consists of weights in the morning, a hike or boxing in the afternoon and cardio at night time. However, Adele has said that her weight loss journey was very personal and insists she never felt that she needed to slim down. Speaking of her newfound love for fitness, Adele told Oprah in 2021 that she had started deadlifting with just 10 pounds and slowly worked her way up to a humongous 170 pounds. Contrary to popular belief, Adele successfully shed 100 pounds the old-fashioned way by consistently lifting weights and doing circuit training. Although her weight loss may seem like it happened overnight, the star worked towards her physical and mental health goals over a two-year period and avoided public attention while she did so. She previously hit back at rumors that she followed some fad diet to shift the pounds as she told Vogue, no intermittent fasting. Nothing. If anything I eat more than I used to because I work out so hard. Paying credit to her personal trainer Greg Miele at Heart and Hustle Gym in Los Angeles, California she said she confessed she has probably spent more time with than anyone else in the last three years. The singer revealed she placed a lot of trust into Miele during a difficult period in her life and praised him for his support. Her weight loss transformation came just months after her divorce to Simon Konecki but the star has hit back at those who assume her body is a way of getting back at her ex. She comically told British Vogue, that whole thing of like, gets revenge body. Oh my god. Suck my D. Backlash Adele received a lot of public backlash after she revealed her new figure as critics claimed that the star had succumbed to the overbearing pressures of unrealistic Hollywood beauty standards. However, the Hello singer hit back at the hate as she insisted she has always been body positive regardless of her size. Speaking of the criticism about her health on Oprah's Adele, one night only CBS special, she said, it's not my job to validate people feel about their bodies. I'm trying to sort my own life out. 
The mom of one argued, my body has been objectified my entire career. Am I too big or am I too small, am I hot or not or whatever, I never looked up to anyone because of their body when asked why she was not more public about her weight loss journey on social media, the singer said she simply didn't feel the need to share as she told Vogue, I did it for myself and not anyone else. She reminded fans that, you don't need to be overweight to be body positive, you can be any shape or size. Divorce Adele and Simon Konecki first started dating in 2011 and welcomed their son Angelo into the world in October 2012. Previous reports stated that Adele and Simon Konecki were married in 2016 but the 34-year-old set the record straight in 2021 when she told British Vogue she actually tied the knot in 2018 when she was 30 years old. However, in 2019 the Chasing Pavements star filed for divorce in 2019 just months into the marriage, but insists that nothing bad happened between them and that she was just going through the motions. She told Vogue, neither of us did anything wrong. Neither of us hurt each other or anything like that. It was just, I want my son to see me really love, and be loved. It's really important to me. It just wasn't right for me anymore. I didn't want to end up like a lot of other people I knew. I wasn't miserable miserable, but I would have been miserable had I not put myself first. However, the pair are determined to remain on good terms as they share joint custody of their now 10-year-old son and Simon has even moved across the road from Adele's Los Angeles mansion to co-parent Angelo. Adele has admitted she is disappointed in herself about how short-lived her marriage as she said how much she had wanted her son to grow up without separated parents. Speaking of her son's upset, she told Vogue, I'm still not fully over it, me choosing to dismantle my child's life for my own makes me very uncomfortable. She also revealed that her number one hit single Go Easy On Me is a song she's written to Angelo about his parents' divorce in the hope that he will understand her decision when has sold her. Adele and Konakis' divorce was finalized in March 2021 but the Grammy Award winner only has good things to say about her ex-husband as she said, I definitely chose the perfect person to have my child with. New love life Adele now has a new romance on the go with sports agent Rich Paul who she has been linked to since early 2021. The pair first met at a mutual friend's birthday party and sparked dating rumors after they were pictured getting cozy at several NBA games together. Adele and Rich have been happily dating for two years after they went public with their relationship in the summer of 2021 and now live together in their Beverly Hills mansion. During her CBS special Adele One Night Only with Oprah Winfrey in 2021, the singer gushed about her new smart and hilarious bow as she shared that their relationship is the first time she's loved myself and been open to loving and being loved by someone else. The loved up couple also sparked engagement rumors at the Brits in February last year when Adele was seen wearing a diamond ring on the red carpet. When asked about the speculation on the Graham Norton show she cheekily responded, while pointing to her rock as if I would ever tell anyone if I was or wasn't, it's lovely though, isn't it? Paul who is a long-term friend and agent of NBA star LeBron James also openly discussed the couple's future as he spoke of the possibility of becoming a parent again in the future, having already fathered three kids from a previous relationship. He told D. News, if I was to have more kids, I'm looking forward to being a different dad, a more patient dad. Meanwhile Adele also publicly confirmed in an interview with Elle, I definitely want more kids. 
The star has also reportedly not ruled out another marriage despite her first one only lasting a matter of months as she said she would absolutely remarry again. The Make You Feel My Love singer is seemingly head over heels for Paul as she proudly confessed in her cover story for El September issue, I've never been in love like this. I'm obsessed with him. Get the latest celebrity gossip and tally news sent straight to your inbox. Sign up to our daily showbiz newsletter here.